Hey there and welcome to Simple Home Science. My name's Chris and in this video we're taking a look at a very unusual theropod dinosaur discovered right here in England, the Baryonyx. So if you're ready explorers, let's go. The Baryonyx was a theropod dinosaur that belonged to the Spinosauridae family, closely related to the Suchomimus and the Spinosaurus. Baryonyx lived around 125 to 130 million years ago during a period of time known as the Early Cretaceous. Baryonyx was first discovered in Surrey, England in 1983 by an amateur fossil hunter called William Walker. He first discovered the large fossilised claw while searching in a clay pit. A team of experts were sent from the Natural History Museum in London to uncover the rest of the dinosaur's skeleton. Since Walker's discovery, additional Baryonyx specimens have been found in Spain and Portugal. The Baryonyx was bipedal, this means the dinosaur walked on its two hind legs and had a large tail to provide balance. Like its cousins, the Suchomimus and the Spinosaurus, the Baryonyx had a long narrow skull which resembled that of a modern day crocodile. Its jaws were filled with around 96 cone shaped teeth, 64 small teeth in the lower jaw and 32 larger teeth in the upper jaw. The jaws of Baryonyx were angled, which helped prevent prey from wriggling free once it had been caught. The Baryonyx had a straight neck which is unusual for theropod dinosaurs who normally had S-shaped necks. Like other theropod dinosaurs, the Baryonyx had two front arms called forelimbs. These forelimbs were powerful and contained a large claw on each thumb. This claw could reach around 12 inches in length and this claw is where the dinosaur gets its name from. Baryonyx translates as heavy claw. The Baryonyx was primarily a piscivore, a fish eating dinosaur but may have also hunted other dinosaurs too, even possibly spending time as a scavenger. It is thought that the Baryonyx hunted for fish in much the same way as modern grizzly bears hunt for salmon, sweeping its claws back and forth across the surface of rivers and lakes, but it may have also spent some time as a quadruped walking on all fours, wading through streams and rivers, snatching at fish with its jaws. This dinosaur was the first fish-eating dinosaur to have been discovered and one of the first carnivorous dinosaurs to be discovered in the United Kingdom. Baryonyx was not fully aquatic but it is believed the dinosaur could swim to some degree and spent a great deal of time in or around water. An adult Baryonyx is estimated to have been able to grow to between 7.5 and 10 metres in length which is 25 to 33 feet and stood around 2.7 metres tall which is 9 feet. They could weigh between 1 and 2 metric tonnes. The Baryonyx was at the top of its food chain and only really had one rival, the Neovanator, a close relative of the North American Allosaurus. Look out for the Baryonyx in the latest instalment of the Jurassic Park franchise, Jurassic World Fallen Kingdom. Thanks for watching. If you've enjoyed this video, be sure to hit that like button, it really does help the channel out. Subscribe if you haven't already, and until next time, see ya!